Hey guys, so um, we've been doing something kind of like the Dave Ramsey program to where we're bringing out cash and putting it in envelopes and using cash for a lot of our stuff. So I figured I'd record that, um, the stuffing of the envelopes I guess, um, and see how you guys liked it. If you guys don't like it, just let me know and I won't do it anymore. Um, this month I had to take out a little extra because there's a few extra things um, that would usually happen. Um, so yeah, we're going to get started. Um, I'm going to start with uh, dates and um, this includes um, us going out and, you know, spending, you know, on a date and then also paying for babysitting. So um, we do 70 for that. So there's 70 there. And this is for the full month of May. I forgot to say, I do my envelopes uh, monthly. Um, the next is school. This is for all the, it, it's the last month of school from a little girl. So they have a lot of different things. Like, you know, you have, this month we have teacher appreciation week. Um, you have um, end of school parties. So you need donations, um, teachers gifts at the end of the year. Um, so it's a, it's more than we would usually put towards um, school stuff as well. So I'm doing 75 for school stuff. So that's 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, and 5. And it goes in there. A lot of months that one doesn't really get anything. Um, hair. So that's for haircuts. Um, that's just for my husband this month. He's the only one that needs a haircut. Um, and we have. Uh, Twenty in here already from the previous month. So he's getting two this month, so that's our hair one. Uh, next is medical, medical and dental. Um, we don't have dental insurance, so because of that, we pay for all our dental stuff out of pocket. And um, this month he has a, a wisdom tooth being taken out, so we're gonna pay for that. And then I put money aside for our cleaning, basically as well. So that is one, two, three, four, fifty for um, the tooth extraction and forty for our cleanings. And that will go into our medical envelope. Uh, next, I have uh, Christmas and gifts. And this is basically in case I'm at the store and I happen to see anything on sale or anything uh, or if we have a birthday coming up I start shopping for Christmas basically right after Christmas so I'm gonna put a hundred okay sorry about that my card got full so I have to change it so yeah basically I put a hundred into our Christmas and gift fund um, so that's that when we go to Disneyland I like taking money because um, we got to pay for parking um, and then if we happen to get a snack or something inside, I'd rather have the cash for that. Otherwise, it's a lot easier to swipe the card and we overspend. So, um, I always take, um, depending on how many times we go a month, we take our cash. So, um, I do 50 every single time because it's 20 for parking. There's 20, 40, 60... 70, 80, 90, 100. We're planning on going twice this month. If we don't, then, you know, we don't. Okay. That's 100 for Disney. And then my husband gets 100, I mean 150, and I get 50, and this is our spending money for the month. So we'll put that in our wallets. Next is our restaurants wherever we eat out. So... Um, that's a hundred for that. 20, 40, 60, 31. And this is as a family. If we happen to get pizza, if we um, are out and want some Chipotle, <coughs> bless you, sweetheart. Or if we go, you know, to a restaurant of some sort, we set aside a hundred dollars for that. Um, and that goes in my wallet as well. And I'll show you guys that in a bit. And then household and pet is a hundred. And then the rest is groceries. I already went grocery shopping, so it I budgeted for $800 for groceries. So we'll see how that works out this month. 
So there's a uh, one, two, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, so that's 500, 10, 20, 30, 40, 2. That's what I have left from going grocery shopping yesterday, so this is supposed to last us through the rest of the month with, obviously, this um, as part of it. So this is our grocery money. Okay, so then this is my wallet right here, and then I just have these little dividers in here that I made for myself, um, and I have it separated as this, like my money. When I go to the grocery store, I take out some from the envelope and I put it in here. This is our restaurant money and then other, so if we go to Disneyland, it goes here. If uh, we're going on a date, it goes there, you know? Um, so I'm going to put the money that I took out for this in here. So we'll start with... Well, my husband, he'll get his. So we'll start with mine. So my 50 goes in here. And I have some money left over from last month. I have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I have $14 left. And I just, I, I don't take my money out and adjust or anything. Because, you know, I like saving up for other things. So there's that. Nothing's going into grocery because we already went. Um, but then the other hundred that I have here is going into food. That way if we are out, um, you know, and we need to go to a restaurant, we can get that. I'm going to laminate these two um, so they can be a little sturdier. But yeah. Um, so yeah, this is uh, basically our cash system at the moment. Um, as I said, I have groceries, a grocery envelope, Disney, Christmas and gifts, medical, uh, hair, school, and dates for this month. Um, so yeah, that's all for this video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Let me know what you guys think. Um, please subscribe if you haven't done so already, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!